think preparation, or better known as pre-running. This is the most fun time of the year. All the boys get together and go down the track and do nothing but sink, piss and ride dirt bikes all weekend. Good fun, hey? Uh, yeah. no, we had a good day yesterday and then just yeah. uh, camped out here tonight and yeah, ready cool. to go again today, so yeah, keen cool. to get down track and have a bit of fun, eh? Hey? Sweet, how's the bike feeling? It's mad, loving it. So, yeah. uh, no drama so far, set up sick and good power, so yeah, uh, it's good fun. Ready to send it. Ready to send up. Fucking on. <laughs> <laughs>
can't see me like hanging off the well, back. You were moving. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Where was the trail, Rossi? Oh, yeah. Go the other way. Go the other way. Like in line with the Barbie. Dab Barbie. Yeah. Dab gas. Like here, Dab like right where your foot is, like Dude, there. Get another insulin. Jerry, Callum. F me. Not that oh, one. Got a quick release. It's all right. Oh. Callum. Where you from? Bring this Hold it back. Pull, Pull the foreskin back. Your back, back. Bro. You should be pretty good at that. You're on the forest. No. Yeah. Yeah, make sure you stay away oh, from that oh, your, oh, your, oh, your oh, toes are on fire enough. there. Looks like a water truck. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, probably safe. Oh, Wait, we have no other firewood. Mm. Anyone else caught on to that? Let's get Oh no. Jesus. Wait, team. It's a Barbie! It's a Barbie! Oh. Oh. That's a good driver or a bad driver. Oh. Oh. You're a fucking wood. Holy oh. Santa Claus shit. <laughs> oh Rick, what happened mate? It took that light from here. Can I? Can I? Can I? This one is. Eight. Yeah. Like that? You yeah, you gotta walk over it. You can't walk <laughs> through it. <laughs> All right, we pick, we pick and pegs. Who goes first, or what? Hang on. Yeah, uh, you're up. Right. The fire's not big enough. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> now go. Oh, there. There's Rob. Yeah, yeah. Good. Oh, he's done. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sussing it. I need. Mean, it's pretty solid, actually. It's actually it's an odd thing. <laughs> Bad, actually. Yeah, I'm glad I went first. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, that was pretty good. It'll do nothing because as soon as it pops the lid, it'll just go woof. Tell them what it's going to do. Put some in a plastic bottle. Whoa! Hang on. Oh, what the fuck? What the Dobby got the number one again this year. Uh, what sort of training do you do to stay fit for Fink? Uh, my training consists of a lot of bike time. I, I feel like you can't really replace, uh, you know, the, the amount of riding that you do on a dirt bike. It's, it's different training to anything else. So this year I focus a lot on, yeah, just getting bike time in and, and spending as much time on it as I can. If you had to answer which year has been your best year out of all the years you've raced Fink, if you had to pick one. Uh, it'd probably be 2019, getting that first win, getting yeah. the you know the monkey off the back. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Felt really good to finally win it, and yeah, I, I think that was probably my best year. Tell me a bit about that year. Was it from 28th to second? Yeah, yeah. So it was 2018. I had a bad prologue, um, and yeah, that year I, I I don't know. I sort of wasn't nervous anymore. I sort of was just really focused on the job at hand. I knew we had a lot of spots to make up, and. And yeah, I just, I had to, I'd done the work all year, so I just couldn't let the boys down and the team, and uh, yeah, just had to focus and really push hard all the way down. Yeah. Was, yeah, really good. Yeah. What's your plan of attack for this year for race day? Pretty, how, how's it all feeling? No, I'm feeling really good. Uh, looking forward to prologue, and I think prologue's pretty crucial. You need to be on those first two grids, I believe, and um, to, you know, so your weekend's set up pretty well. Yeah. And then uh, just try and sprint to Fink as quick as we can and, and hopefully get there fast and, and then uh, assess again and see what day two holds for us. Do you have any tips or tricks you can pass on to any competitors racing this year's Fink Desert Race? <laughs> uh, just, I don't know, look up a bit more, look for holes and make sure you stay out of those buggy ruts and you'll be right. <laughs> Sponsors and that you'd like to thank this year? Uh, obviously KDM Australia, they've been really good to me. Um, Heath Motor Group, Oscon, um, GDR Suspension, couldn't do it without him. Greeny's just the best there is. Uh, Alpine Stars, Oakley, Pod Knee Braces, 
Um, you know, there's so many people that help put yeah. this together, and um, I couldn't do it without them. So thanks heaps. Cool. Uh, when do you think you'll hang the boots up? <laughs> I thought five years ago, but <laughs> I'm still here. So You're still here, bros. Who knows? I don't know yeah. when I'll be done. <laughs> you got to rep the number one, eh? You can't leave it on hanging on the wall. Yeah, nah. It's, I definitely had to come back and defend it. So yeah, we'll see what happens this year. Cool. All the best, mate. Thanks, mate. Thank <laughs> you. 
Prologue done and all the boys across the line safely, it's time to send it down for the Fink weekend. Uh, give us an update, Seymour. What's the go with the uh, Fink Desert Race weekend, mate? Pretty much disappointed with everyone's uh, input. Yeah, not good enough. There's just no one putting any good innings, and uh, we're really lacking up the backfield there. And it's just, I, can't, I just can't, mate. You have to stop. Just can't do it too hard. We can't be free! <laughs> Oh, 
Who's going to come through first tomorrow? I reckon Dobby for sure. Yeah. But I reckon. <laughs> Who do you think is going to come? Who? Uh, Dobby or what? Dobby? Yeah. Or are you Dobby? Dobby. Dobby. Dobby for number one. Bring it home for the boys.
Oh, just tell brother, bro. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Is that that Rory Hill? How did you go off the start? Pretty good, like smoked it. I can't remember who I was starting with, but I know I didn't see him like after him. Like when that light went green, yeah, all I saw was clean air. Yeah, right. So you basically hose Dobby, Simo, and Smithy off the start. Yeah, I took my goggles off like straight away because just to get some fresh air. Yeah, getting a bit of glare off them. Yeah, and you obviously had a dust free run the whole yeah, way. Yeah, I like being as natural as possible. Fuel stops were all good. No. Nah. No. Nah. I got stuck there for like five minutes each How's stop. But you still got into Fink first, right? Yeah. Shit. I don't know what them other doing, but... At first fuel, he had a minute. Yeah. He was, he was, yeah. He was lapping. It was, eh? Yeah. He had a minute. He was, he was easy lapping. I swapped the whole way through Bunduma. I've been around the world a couple of times, and maybe seen the sights. I've had the lights on every foreign shore. But when my mates all asked me the place that I had all, I told them right away. Ah.
Give me a heart, my man, I come Well, it's a plum tree A sheep, a tuak, a kangaroo A clove on out the back Veranda out the front And an old rocking chair Maybe. Two of them.
this looks like Braddo. Yeah, I reckon that's Braddo. Go, Braddo! Yes! Go, Braddo! Wait, is that all? Oh, that's I think that's Ashby. Just had a massive swap on the left. Day two is done, and just like that, the Fink Desert Race 2022 weekend is over, with all the boys crossing the line safe and sound as I cheer them through. But there's still one more night to go. And I was event director for this weekend. Yeah, look, mate, back in my day, it wasn't a four wheel drive track, like it was big whoops, but. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Probably Alice Springs' favourite son, number one in first place in three hours and 35 minutes, David Walsh! Yeah, I was way down, I think. Seats, Steg Pegs, uh, Vortex, Custom MX, EK Chains, Super Sprocks, Twin Air, IMS, a Service, Alpine Stars, Oakley and Pod, uh, GDR Suspension, Tata Security, GGS, Class and Aluminium, um, Carusi Motorsports, Apro Motorsports, um, Blizzard's Kitchen, and <laughs> Kate, and <laughs> Kate is and Jack. Um, I've had a lot of people support me, it's, you can't, you know, you can't do this race without support and, uh, you know, family, friends, whoever it may be, you know, I wouldn't be here without you all and, um, yeah, Carusi, you know, you've been a big part of this, so thanks heaps, mate. Uh, Greeny, your suspension, second to none and, yeah, it really proved down the track, there was some pretty nasty holes we hit and the bike was amazing, so thanks heaps for that and, uh, yeah, enjoy. On you, Greeny. When's your rego due? <laughs> I don't have a rego. Right. What colour bed sheets are you wearing at the moment? I don't have bed sheets either. Oh, that's fair enough. What number are you? What number? Yeah, what? what? It's 49. No, no, what number are you finished? Oh, okay. <laughs> 49. 49, that's pretty good, top 20. That's 49. Top 20! <laughs> Go this year, mate. Uh, yeah, look, she was a tough one. Yeah, done, but no problems on the way to Fink. No, pretty much the sail down. Yeah, terrible pylon. 
Oh, yeah, just got dusted. Who's yeah. your favourite mechanic that works on your bike? Is it Dobby? It'd have to be that Nick guy. Nick guy. Oh, he's yeah. pretty good. He's got some good motors in his time. How'd your bike go? No, no, it didn't miss a beat? No, nah, it's pretty good. It so on mechanic was on point? Well, apart from mechanic, what are your thoughts on the mechanic versus Russia at the moment? Mate, it's... I think so. Yeah, but I'm not against that. Yeah, yeah. Let him move. And um, when's your rego due? It's today. I gotta go. Anyway, Stephen. So a lot of lot, yeah. a lot of riders this year in top twenty. Happy with the outcome again? No, he didn't get it. Oh, yeah, no. Not enough bikes upside down this year, so... I didn't, I didn't ride, so... Yeah. So obviously, end up I, think, I think I'm going to try and perfect the, uh, the bike that actually goes on the handlebars and the mudguard. So, I'm on, on a more important turn... <laughs> anyway, on a more important turn... Are you happy with your insurance provider at the moment? Uh, yeah, no, they're, they're actually going pretty good. Living in Harapini, you wouldn't need it. Oh, mate, we are, we are in the, like, the... Like, like just the place where... Insurance premiums are at a maximum purely because of the environment and the, the social economy is just, just, just terrible. It's sensational. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Yeah, there's only three seconds. Yeah. Girls, yeah. Girls don't hear this and long, just to I finish know. it off, when's your rego due? When's your rego due? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, like it's, On the 10th? Uh, the 10th and like, never? Yeah. Uh, I think it's the 22nd of October. <laughs> Yeah. So, bro, pretty happy with the run this year? Yeah, nah. No, 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 no. Not satisfied? Yeah. I see, we're, we're pretty happy to see you up there. Nah, no, it's right. right. It's a good yeah. run. You improved on last year. Yeah. So, your thoughts at the moment? What do you think on the housing market? Ah, uh, terrible. Jobs, didn't it? Jobs, can't sell me else. What can't about make uh, money, border closures, border opening? <laughs> do you think Victoria will pick up some tourism? Yeah. Yeah. So, put that in there. You're going to have to <laughs> When's your rego due? Why not? Point blank, what phone are you running at the moment and what does it cost you a month? <laughs> no idea, you Samsung. <laughs> Samsung? You've heard it here first, this is hey. why Brody Waters did not win. <laughs> no, <laughs> Samsung. Hey, look, mate, pretty average performance today by the boys. No record, but out except Cody Ryan. Well, that's about all I've got to say. Thank you.
Thanks a lot for watching guys and please remember to hit that like and subscribe button and turn on your post notifications for more updates. I uh, just want to say a massive shout out to all the boys who competed in this year's Fink Desert Race. Uh, a huge shout out to my cousin Bradley Greenfield finishing 19th outright. It's such a great weekend, everyone gets around it and uh, yeah, we look forward to next year. Yeah.